In this video, I want us to look at the children's literature and language development. That is to say, the relationship between children's literature and language development. My name is Dr. Kibet from the Center for Open Distance and E-Learning, Machakos University. Language enables children to express themselves and satisfy their needs. Through language, they communicate their feelings to others as they interact with them. Language is an important tool for facilitating learning in early years education. Children should be able to develop oral, reading, and writing skills, which are important in language development. So in this section, I want us to look at how children's literature can aid child, the child in developing oral communication competence. And this can be done through the following ways. One, listening to stories. Teachers should allow children opportunities to listen to stories from the teachers, the resource persons, their fellow children, the media, and the like. Number two, telling stories. Teachers and parents should provide children with time to tell stories either at home or at school. And they should ensure that each child is given an opportunity to tell their stories. Number three, use of puppets. Using puppets during story time can be amusing. They allow children who are shy to be confident and are interested in telling a story. Number four, discussing the story with peers. Teachers should allow children time to discuss stories with peers and even answer questions about the story in their class discussions. Five, wordless picture books. Provide children with wordless picture books actually allows children to discuss the pictures. Children may also use the pictures to tell a story. Drama. After storytelling, the teacher can organize children to dramatize the story, allow children to take up roles of different characters in the same story. Number seven, mimicking. Allow children to mimic some phrases that are repeated in the story. And finally, provide series, series books. Children should be provided with enjoyable series books, series books that have different levels of language difficulty. For example, the hare and the lion series. So that marks the end of my video where I have been looking at the relationship between children's literature and language development. If you like this video, kindly subscribe. You can like or even share it with a friend. 